Ready, Bob? Cool. Welcome to the 2010 UN Summit. Today we're discussing the Millennium Development Goals. The development. <laughs> well, I think to me, in order to. You feel me? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> How can we? We need to. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, instead of this is what we have done, it should be. I need to, how do I overcome this? Oh, okay, to overcome this, you need to do this. Yeah, yeah do this. I need to do that, I need to do that. Do those ones again then. You go to that one. Okay. Whatever it is, is it? So, shut your face. No, but these were written there. Oh, well, some resolution should come up with this. Yeah, there needs to should be. Should there be some sort of like a saying, well, they all inadvertently link to each other, and it's just a vicious cycle? It is the fact that it is in the circle. We can't use vicious cycle because that's just ever so corny, isn't it? It's a vicious cycle. Ever so corny. We need to say something about the fact that it's in the circle, though. And the fact that they. America has been primarily concerned with kind of universal education, primary education for all. Which I think links to eradicating extreme poverty and hunger. In conjunction, I would say you need to promote gender equality and empower women. Problem solved. The whole point is that we're having a debate. You can't just keep going back to the same point. Yeah, right. point. You can't. Yeah, but it's a circle. circle. It's not. It's a circle it that it all derives not with this. this. If you don't have education, then you can't learn about anything. It would be a pyramid if it all derives. But if we do something about this now. Do something about this now. Why is that to be that? No, but if we do something about this now, when people are educated, trying to get that equal sort of communication with all parts of the world, so we can we can educate people because they're not going to. There's not. What is the other? This is the important one. No, it's not. You've got this whole fascination with global warming. It's always the global warming. It's not. It's it not. is. <laughs> <laughs> Ready, Bob? Poverty, the health, the education, and all that. And okay, let's and say. Development and sustaining youth because it's all one big area, not just the environmental. No, but can't you, can't you just see that this, this, none of this will be feasible if we don't do this first? Yeah, that's a fact. You can say. Rob? If anything, that should be number one, surely, if that was the most important. Well, yeah, yeah they just got the, the numbers mixed up. Yeah. <laughs> but it's, it's, that is the point. Whose phone's on? I told, told you guys, phone's off. Sorry. Before the meeting began. That's the important one. Are Why? You know, are you know? No, I'm not going to back down. I think this is silly. Well, whatever you want. So you can mess up the actual exercise. Because if you improve your thermal health, You'll reduce child mortality. Yeah, but child mortality is like, it comes from many different things and it doesn't have to be from maternal health. I don't know, like warfare and stuff like that, you know, guns and stuff. It doesn't have to be from, you know, maternal um, health. I, um, See what I mean? So when child mortality, as in the actual disease and yeah, public again, everything moves together. Oh, we're going to global warming. Hello Rob, sorry about this, but um, don't worry about these two, it's all about number seven. Um, kind of the global warming thing is the one that we need to focus on the most, I think. They just talk rubbish, they just go over and over the same things all the time, and it doesn't work. They just talk and talk about anything. Come on, guy. Off again. Well, that, that number seven is the one. Number seven is the one. I hate water. He's not telling the truth. On water. Oh, it's water. It's all about number seven. Water, water, water. How's that off?